Hi there. Over the last few years, I've been thinking about knowledge work and in particular the kind of knowledge work that academics do. And I've come to the realization that I don't think that this is something that I do very well. And I was thinking about using this YouTube channel as a way for me to explore in public different ways of thinking about knowledge work. Um, specifically, I want to try and figure out how we can use uh, systems to get better at turning information into something valuable. I think that fundamentally the job of an academic is to take information um, that they get from a variety of sources and to turn that information into something that other people find uh, useful. So I don't have any answers um, for, for how this is going to work, but I know that um, this is a problem that's broader than just me. Um, if you think about athletes and musicians, um, they have very systematic, very structured ways of getting better at what they do. And they've got very good milestones that they understand or that they can use to understand how they're tracking progress over time. Now, if I think about the last 15 so years that I've been an academic, I can't really think of any milestones that I can hit as part of a systematic process where I can say yes, I'm definitely getting better at turning information into something valuable. So there are things like publications, postgraduate degrees. Um, these things we can get some measure of, of, of how well we're improving, but they're very, very narrow in scope. And I think that the work of an academic is so much bigger than just publication and research. And so I'd like to think in public um, or rather share in public some of the ways that I think about uh, knowledge work as an academic. Um, think about going to a conference. You go to a conference, you get funding. How many of us go to the conference with a, an agenda? Um, a very specific set of tasks that we want to complete as part of our movement towards the achievement of a bigger objective. Um, and then when we come back from the conference, we may have to submit a report, but that report typically goes to a committee and the committee looks at it and says, yes, this is a report. Um, there's nothing that ever happens as a result of having attended that conference where we can take what we've learned and use it in a systematic way um, to, to measure our achievement towards uh, certain goals. That's kind of like an athlete walking off a field and no one talking to them about the game um, or specifically about their game and what they need to do at the next practice session in order to get better to fill in the gaps that the coach identified during the match. A university is like a, um, a, university is like a group of professional athletes who never train. Um, we, we practice, we go to conferences, we go to workshops, we write papers, um, we may attend workshops on how to write better papers, but there's no kind of career trajectory that allows you to map out um, how to get from point A to point B. Um, there's not even a framework for how to manage your day or your week. So you can go to work and you can spend your entire day in email. This is not the job of an academic. Um, this is not the work that we should be doing to get better at turning information into valuable ideas. And yet, for many academics, it seems like going into their office um, and starting the day with no structure is the norm rather than the exception. And I think that we can use... Uh, I think it might be reasonable to start talking about some of the things that we could be doing as academics that would make us better at knowledge work. So this is the idea around this channel. Um, maybe it will be useful for other people, but I think for myself it's going to be a way for me to think about my own practice, my own training, um, and the kinds of things that I want to be doing as an academic, um, and the kinds of things that I want to be doing to get better as an academic. So yeah, if you think that this is useful, maybe subscribe. Um, if not, then don't.
If you think that this might be interesting or useful for you, then maybe consider subscribing. Um, and yeah, I'll try and put some of these out uh, over the next few weeks or so. And let's see if there's anything useful there. Cheers. I'll see you soon.